Ah, you've returned. You must have talked to Tarun by now. Did you make it out to the estate? Did you? Did you see the mask? Wasn't it amazing? I have the mask right here. Oh, you have it. I never thought I'd see it again. Free from Grathen's prison at last. Free from the hands of heretics. It's a wonderful day. My trial is complete. The mask is yours now. I wish I'd been there, cutting Grathen's apprentices to pieces again and again. But it was your trial, your privilege. I have a gift for you, to celebrate your success and the completion of the rite. I can't finish your initiation, only the master can do that. But I can recognize achievement. You've done so very well. The mask will guide us forevermore. More initiates. Hmm. The compound's getting less secure all the time. Still, I suppose the Master knows what he's doing. And if you can follow the ways of Revan, we'll judge your worth. What ways are you talking about? Revan didn't work alone. Revan had allies, all walks of life. We're no different. You want to join us? You need to face the men and women who got here first and who've proved that they're loyal to the Master. Sounds like a huge waste of my time. Then maybe we shouldn't bother with you at all. You need to show those in the Master's inner circle that you understand of Revan's teachings. They'll ask questions. You'll answer. If they're not satisfied, they'll abandon the test of wisdom and begin your test of strength. Revan didn't suffer the weak. Just show me where the fun is. Your pilgrimage starts in the jungle. You'll find your first guide there. He'll determine whether you're worth sending on to the rest. Be ready for anything, Initiate. The jungle's dangerous, and so are the true Revanites. So, you have come. You who would join the Order of Revan. I am Moron Dokas, Lord of Beasts. I am Revanite, and I am Sith. What do you say to me? What do you expect me to say? I am very impressed. I do not need your praise, Initiate. For decades I have served the Master. He found me when I was a lava and saw that I was strong in the Force. Against the Empire's traditions, he trained me. This is the way of Revan, to teach all species the path to power. What's your point, exactly? It is something you must consider if you are to be a Revanite. It will shape you, change you. Now you will answer a question. And you will answer well, or face the claws of my pets. Why do you think Revan trained aliens in the ways of the Sith? Why did Revan offer power to all Seekers? Revan knew that servants are more useful when they're powerful. You answer well. You answer wisely. You speak like a true Revanite. You may proceed on your pilgrimage and seek worth in the eyes of another. Who should I be looking for? A Revanite. A great warrior. 
and a favored student of the master. Seek the mercenary called Setafar as she teaches her soldiers. Then shall your trial continue. Talking. Have some of the men head into the city. They've earned a break from training. Yes, Commander. It's good to see you alive. Not everyone makes it past Morin. Raymond contacted me from the base. Said you wanted to join our society. Is it true? It's true. I'm seeking the approval of the Inner Circle. I'm called Setafar. I teach these mercenaries how to fight. My service to the Master is a matter of honor. Centuries ago, my clan fought Revan when we invaded the Republic with the rest of the Mandalorians. It was our privilege to battle Jedi. We lost the war over Malkor V, but that was a privilege too. It's out of respect for Revan that I agreed to join the Master. I don't quite understand. Mandalorians honor their foes. We respect a hard-earned victory. I serve the order to ensure Revan's name isn't forgotten. Revan was a warrior, a leader, and deserves to be remembered. Since you're not bound by honor, how do I know you won't sully the Dark Lord's memory? What can you do for the order in Revan's name? I can fight. I'll battle the order's enemies wherever there's need. Good. But I need proof of that. I sent out a squad of clansmen to hunt the local wildlife. They're camped nearby. Defeat them, or get yourself killed. And don't worry. Talking here will make sure they know you're coming. Yes, Commander.
too easy. Oh. Not even a challenge. Revan earned the respect of my grandfathers and grandmothers by defeating them in battle. Now you've earned mine. You're not Revan. Not yet, at least. But you're something. You've got my approval to join the Order. Are we finished? I'm finished. You're not. You'll need to talk to one more person before you head back to the compound. Find Major Pathel. He oversees security on the wall. This is beneath me, but I'll do it. Glory to Mandalore, and glory to our master. Over. There's nothing to trouble us here, and we can speak freely. I'm Major Pathel, at your service. It's always wonderful to meet new initiates. The Order of Revan needs all the dedicated young people it can get. Don't waste my time. I'm here about initiation. Of course. We both have business outside the Revanites to get back to. I don't know how your other meetings went, but I like to conduct these interviews informally. No point making your life difficult, eh? Quite a few initiates, young officers, acolytes and the like, think our secret society will help them become morphs or dark lords. You're not like that, I presume? The Order of Revan intrigues me, but I don't need it to get what I want. You're ambitious, that's a fine trait. Don't let it get the better of you, though. Not every initiate realizes that advancement in the Revanites does not guarantee advancement in the Empire, nor how dangerous being a Revanite really is. The Dark Council seeks to root us out. So, how do we respond? How do we answer the Empire's accusations of heresy? We respond by destroying our foes. Any who speak against us will fall. Uh, I was afraid you might say that. Alas, I'm a patriot, and I'm not interested in turning the Revanites against the Empire. This is Major Pathel to all security droids. We have a threat on the wall. Please eliminate. There. If you survive that, perhaps I'll reconsider my decision. say, I didn't think you were capable of so much destruction. You've got some rough edges and, and, and some misconceptions, but also potential to be of real value to the Order. 
Glad you could see reason. That's all I needed to make my judgment. I'm going to send a message to the compound. Raymond will be waiting for you. If everything's settled, I'll be leaving. Journey safely, and be proud to be a part of the Order of Revan. So you finished the pilgrimage. Not bad. I don't know what happened out there. It's none of my business. But the inner circle approves of your initiation. Glad to hear it. You did good in this trial. Now you'll have to find someone else to show you the next stage of the journey. If that's right, I have no more need for you. Good luck. Every step brings you closer to the master. Well, you really made it, didn't you? I've been hearing a lot about your progress, hearing about your trials. Your initiation has not been an easy one, but you've met the challenge and showed you can walk Revan's path. Now you may undergo the final rite. That certainly took long enough. This won't be a waste. This time, you're ready. The Master will complete your lessons, and you'll be welcomed as a full member of the Order of Revan. This is a great privilege. The Master reveals himself to no one outside the Order. At last, the respect I deserve. You may go to the Master in his chamber. He'll be waiting for you. Listen to him, obey him. Through the Master, you will know the path of Revan. been reborn. Stand before me now. You who have reclaimed the ancient past, stand before me now. You who have demonstrated power and wisdom to my followers, look upon the master of the Order of River. Are you too afraid to show your face? Silence! This is the end of your initiation and the beginning of your true journey. You will walk the path of Revan forevermore. The enemies of the Order will force you to move in shadows. But we shall keep your secrets safe, as you shall keep ours. The time for subterfuge is over. Know me for who I am. So, the Puppet Master is revealed. I apologize for the deception, and for not meeting you sooner, but you must know how badly the Dark Council wants me dead. The Order of Revan threatens everything the Dark Council prizes. What makes the Order such a threat? Revan came to Drummond Castle after being reborn. Some believe Revan died at the hands of our Emperor. I believe otherwise. I believe Revan overthrew the Emperor and has sat secretly on the throne for three centuries. Aside from our order, only the Dark Council knows the truth. You really think Revan replaced the Emperor? I do. It's the only way the puzzle pieces fit. I have heard whispers in the Citadel. For decades, the Emperor has been in seclusion. The Dark Council no longer speaks with him. The only explanation is this. 
The Dark Council betrayed their leader and locked Emperor Revan away, seizing power for themselves. They seek to silence us because we know. We shouldn't let them get away with this. We won't. It will take many years to free the Emperor, however, and first I need your help on a different matter. My agents tell me that you met with a Sith named Sandor, a man who seeks to destroy the Revanites. End his threat. Go to Sandor and tell him that you met the Revanite leader. Tell him that the leader is his own master, Darth Charnas. Why would he believe me? I obtained this Sith amulet from Charnas. Give it to Sandor. He'll believe you stole it from his master while among the Revanites. They will turn against each other. When this is done, though, when you've spoken to Sandor, you cannot return here. Somehow, I'm not terribly disappointed. Sandor must never suspect your true allegiance. You must walk the path of Revan on your own. The path to power. The path neither Jedi nor Sith. May the Force be with you. May it make you strong. Never slave turned master. You return from having your ears filled with lies by the Revanites. I do not envy you the experience. Tell me now, did you find what we need? Did you see the face of the leader? She's a Sith Lord. Dark skinned with black hair and tattoos. I know her. I know her. Yes. Tari Darkspanner. My master knows her. We will use her. The Dark Council will strip her of her power, her mind, and her life. That makes a certain sense. I promised you a reward in the name of Darth Charnas. So you shall have it. You have served the Empire well. Thanks to you, we have the means to obliterate this society of heretics. The name of Revan will be spoken on Drummond Cast no more. It just seems like a waste. Better to snuff out the plague than to let it spread. Leave me now. It is time to put Darth Charnas's plans into action. 